I'm so sorry I lost my time. I didn't mean for us to get caught out here after dark, but there's really nothing to be afraid of. The night is the same as the forest during the day. Only darker. Still, maybe we should hurry back to the cottage. <laughs> Come back here. Dominate those ten kettles once again. So, so what should we do tonight, Pinchy? Tomorrow, huh? Oh, okay. Let's have some fun. Days were continuing. Diesel 10 was up to no good. Then he decided to try another type of trick, but this time on the other engines. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Our Thomas. Hello, Diesel 10. What can I do for you? Here's a present for you. Take a look at Pinchy. <gasps> gotcha. Put it down. Just do it to the rest of them if you like. About the silly guy cookie drive, but I still have to do a few finishing touches on your uniform. Hmm, not bad. Uh, you asked for it. What does it mean? Uh, I assume this is Dash's idea of a prank. Oh, 
Thomas, are you playing a trick on me? But Percy couldn't see Thomas anywhere. So I wonder what is happening. Wait, something doesn't feel right. Is it something heavy for me? <laughs> oh. oh, this is so heavy. How is, who's going to help me? Oh, now is my lamp's powered down. Maybe I'll need a flashlight. I've got a flashlight right here. Oh, thank you. Ah, diesel turn. <laughs> I've got you once again, green caterpillar. No. once again Gotcha! Whoa! <laughs> this went on and on until everyone had had enough of Diesel 10's tricks. Everyone was so bored and they wanted Diesel 10 to stop his tricks. But they did but they all didn't know how they were going to stop him doing from doing those tricks. And they needed someone's help, but which help would they find? Gotcha! gotcha. Catch me if you can! to agree with Paxton, so she tried to. <laughs> At the Diesel Works, Diesel 10 was laughing about how his pranks had gone well as planned. Cookies are being held by the Cutie Mark Crusaders. So how about I can switch them for joke cookies that will make every pony's mouth round, mouth rainbow and make the engines feel silly by giving them no coal or water instead of giving them joke coal and water. Eh, hey, Paxton? Eh? Hey? Aren't you answering me? Aren't you answering me yet, Paxton? <coughs> huh? <coughs> Actually, I 
don't feel good, Diesel 10. Why on have not? Because... Because... <coughs> I think I'm sick. Why are you sick already? Because... <gasps> it's because of any virus that has been spreading. <coughs> Wait, I need to get back to my shed. Unless anyone can get me a tow. Bye. No. Then Diesel 10 decided to show up to Sugar Cube Corner to try prank Pinkie Pie instead. Oh, Pinkie Pie, I have a surprise for you. Pinkie Pie? Uh, Pinkie Pie? Oh, no, not you. You Now you're feeling absolutely sick like Paxton. Oh, right, joke cookies. I forgot to give you them. You don't have any more, do you? I know, but hopefully I get to do something else when Paxton is feeling a bit better. Two hours later. When it was time to deliver all the Philly Guide cookies, Applejack, Rarity, and the Cutie Mark Crusaders, and James and Toby needed Diesel 10's help to load them onto the truck. I know when we're done, we could get some garland. But what is garland? We'll talk about it later. Then they visited the castle of friendship. I'll knock the door with Pinchy. <laughs> then they delivered more. And then and every and then the next minute they needed more and more to keep up. so bad after all now that he'd help us. She's probably gonna spend time with Gordon for a minute. Yeah. Any moment now. Any moment now for what? Uh, nothing. Nothing. I don't... Nothing. I've just realized I've got different important business with Pinchy to do. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Well, we can help you with that. I don't need help from puffballs who always think they can do better than Diesel's do. Well, they're wrong. And then when the steamies do anything else, they make all oh, the noise, all oh, the noise, 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 noise. How they crash on differences and born on boy boundaries. 
uh, when he went around Ponyville, any type of things, Diesel 10 couldn't see anybody anywhere. Okay, definitely different, different bits going around, but, but, okay, okay, there is definitely good joke cookie eating stuff that will make every pony's mouth rainbow whenever they eat them, and how I'm going to give all the engines the wrong coal, how I've featured coal trucks with James Toby and those silly crusaders. They should all be running out into the streets. Unless everybody went to bed early. I'll just go check up on Paxton if it's fine with me. So Diesel 10 checked up on Paxton at first and just needed his help to find him. But first, he went to check up on Sugar Cube Connor for a minute. Hello? Anyone here? Uh, huh, huh, huh. The whole town of Sodor and Equestria got the joke cookies and the wrong coal, and now everybody shut up in their houses. You don't think there's anything wrong, Pinchy? Pinchy? <laughs> Oh, uh, okay, what was that? Dieselton's claw opened up so that he could check a closer look. Mrs. Cake! Phew! Where's Paxton? I was thinking I might have something to do with him not feeling great. Uh, Mrs. Cake? Uh, I can see you're busy. I'll come back. Wait, ow! <laughs> huh? What's going on? What's going on? Huh? <laughs> 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 Diesel 10 was feeling very frightened. No, okay, there's nothing to worry about. Isn't that right, Pidgey? Nothing to worry about. Just a sickly race of mutated genetic disasters. At least 60% of them are born blind. No. Okay, just everything went out of control. I just hope that nothing else is worse than that. Huh? Thomas! You've got to come with me to Sugar Cube Corner. Something's going on with the cakes. Well, not something exactly. I mean, it may have something to do with these gel cookies, and I may have given you and your friends the wrong call. <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> Oh no, not the green lobster. What? <gasps> what? I mean, <gasps> okay, 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 that was bad. That was bad. Uh, I mean, 
Now, Diesel 10 was feeling very frightened. Uh, okay, uh, now I'm scared. He's, he went first, and off he went. And and when he went to, to get to James, Toby, Re Applejack, Rarity, and the CMCs, they were already there with the rest of the Philly Guy cookies. Are you? Are you sure you don't mind us all coming over? Of course not. I think the girls have earned a little celebration for all their hard work. Cake leftovers. Unless any pony wants a cookie. Don't touch those. Oh, there's certainly no call for that. There's plenty for every pony. Come on, we're gonna get out of here. What entire nation are you going on about? There's no time. You need to follow me. Oh, Diesel 10, if you want all of those cookies, you will have to buy them, just like everybody else. I don't want the cookies. Uh, but, but they do. I'll explain later. Come, let's go, Pinchy. Quick, let's let's leg it. Leg it. Oh, I bet I hope Paxton and Philip aren't like them. Cause I'm freaking out already. Hey. We need to find to oh, oh boy. No. Leave us alone. Leave us alone, said Diesel Tank. Then they found a strange ha heaven to find a safe place to hide. <gasps> Did we lose them? Why are we running from the ponies of Ponyville? What happened to all of our friends? Um, I maybe have given the engines, the engines, um, the, the, the wrong call so that, um, it, it just wouldn't be worse if that incident occurred. Oh, now that is ridiculous. Philly Guy cookies and coal for many engines have have not changed in years. Yeah, it's not like there is a new ingredient that's turning the whole island and Equestria into zombies. Um, unless there is. What are you saying? What did you do? <laughs> I'll to cover the windows with Pinchy. Okay, so I may have switched all the Philly Guy cookies for Joe cookies that was supposed to make Pony's Mouth Rainbow, and how I had to switch all of the right coal of the edges for the wrong coal. But somehow turned all the engines and ponies into mindless zombies instead. And maybe we should just hide here till the effects wore off. And as long as nobody else eats cookies and takes the wrong coal, we'll be fine. That's lovely, darling. Except for one thing. No, no, 
no, stay away. I'm making you sick. You don't want to eat me. Oh, please stop. I haven't meant for this to happen. It was just a harmless prank. It was supposed to be funny that I used with pinches, but this isn't funny at all. Exactly. What? Wait, what's happening? Delighting in pranking the prankster. <laughs> yeah, how does it feel to get some of your own medicine? So, you're not sick? None of you are? Of course not! This was all a prank? Yep, and you can thank Paxton. After he told us about your prank, he got a way to figure out how to get rid of your pranks, but pretended that he was sick and that we were all zombies in the first place. Oh, shucks. It's nothing. Just a little something I threw joined in and I was really scared and I'm the one that got pranked you can't just go around pranking whoever you feel like without thinking about how it might make them feel or if they'd even enjoy it or think it's funny <laughs> or if it's a pinch of tan or if something like this like that nasty fumes from a dingy diesel and how about diesels after the lost engine yeah. oh, oh. oh. I see what you did. And I'd like to apologize to you as well, Thomas. I I only used silly con confetti that that was to give you a surprise, even though it was likely something like a joke, which blew pink and white labels on you. I'm sorry. A apology accepted. Well, you, everyone like you pulled up an amazing prank. I'll have to work extra hard to pull something like definitely up to scrap a new steamies. Gotcha. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha,